first. You know what my prediction is? Oh, when ultimate when ultimate comes around, he's gonna main Ryu because they're probably gonna have the bearded Ryu skin for ultimate. That's that's the only scenario where I still main Ryu. <laughs> I wanted the bearded Ryu forever, and I even, like, I had mods. I had, like, 40-some costumes for Ryu on my <laughs> Switch. Or, not on my Switch, on my Wii U, but none of the, nobody ever made the bearded one. That was never yeah. an option. We're getting right into it with uh, Yoshi God's Mario versus Beard Captain Falcon. Yeah, starting out on Smashville in honor of the new Animal Crossing and Isabel. Yeah, that's why. <laughs> Otherwise, yep. we would never start here. Exactly. <laughs> nobody likes these stages. <laughs> Yeah, we just found out Isabel's going to be a smash about 40 minutes ago. Yep. Not even 40. Yeah, but right now, Beardside just really just using that speed of mobility to uh, outspace Shioshkot here. Yeah, this is, matchup is uh, it's weird because all the Falcons I know like it, mm -hmm. even though it's bad. <laughs> that roll read was, <laughs> wow. was a very strange, but it would have co covered neutral get up or roll backwards, so I guess yeah. it was a good option. Um, but yeah, if Mario can grab Falcon, he does a ludicrous amount of damage. But yep. other than that, it's just a good, solid, uh, like, there's, uh, I don't know how to explain it. Neither one of these guys have a solid advantage over the other. Yeah, or they're both even like a, like a specific setup or kill confirm. Like, yep. obviously, Falcon wants the falling up air, yep. but they both kind of just look for stray hard hits. Yeah. Like, they want smash attacks and back airs and things like that. There's no, uh, it's not like when you're playing Sheik or Spouse and it's like, okay, I want to fair him off the ledge and edge guard him or something like that. Yeah. It's just kind of a, a smash. It's a very Smash-esque matchup, I guess, if that makes yeah. any sense. No, that makes perfect sense. I mean, you're not trying to look for a specific kill confirms. Because yeah. it's really hard to get those setups because it feels like the percentage windows are fairly narrow for the things that would normally confirm for both of these characters. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, there's always up air knee, obviously. Yep. But it's just, I don't know. I don't know if Beard goes for those very often. Um, yep. It's more just like trying to bait and punish. Lots of bait and punish. Yep. I like that up air by Oshida. Yeah, to definitely. break out of the jabs. Yeah, he's recognized that Beard inside has been trying to use those jabs to set up for the grabs. Off Smash, not going to take it, though. Yoshkod has not yet taken this first stock still, but. No matter what percentage he's at, there now we. that Cat Falcon is zero, if he can get a grab, he can he can er completely erase this deficit with one grab. <laughs> yeah, and that's a frustrating thing about killing somebody in this game because it's like, oh, I'm out of their kill percent range just because of their rage, and then you kill them, and it's like, oh, now I'm back in them. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Platform coming in handy there. Yeah, uh, a little bit further, and I would have just that was so <laughs> close to spiking. I can't believe he went for that cape stall with the Falcon sitting right there. I don't know, Beard just grabbed Yoshi between his two back airs. Slid backwards a little bit and just grabbed him. And looks like he's got Luigi privilege for a moment there. Just yeah, sliding out. That's 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 actually one of the few benefits of Captain Falcon being very heavy and a fast faller. Is that as long as you're not at a high enough percent for the back air to put you into tumble, yep. it, it, it really didn't have any hits done from that first back air. Yeah. Good on Yoshi got to stall. Oh, he does die. Dang. It looked like he went for an up air there at the blast zone, but I think he probably was dead anyways. Yeah. That's one of the things that really scares me when you're next to the blast zone. It's like, oh, I want to use this move that normally stops my momentum, but sometimes it'll be like it has that wind up where it puts your hand like, yeah, into the blast zone. It's like, oh, you're dead now. His feet go back further than his yep. body would have if he didn't do that. Exactly. Yeah. Now, this is a matchup I was expecting. Getting here. Is it Yoshi? Yep. Yeah. It's Yoshi. Yoshi Falcon is what I expected too. I, I don't. I I'm, I like that Yoshi would try something else and see how it goes. But uh, this is, you know, obviously his name's Yoshi. This is the character he's known for. Yep. So um, he'll definitely be a little bit more comfortable now that he's got a character that he practices with more. Yep. I feel like the Super Emerald will definitely help him get back to the stage if he's ever off. Yeah, uh, Yoshi Falcon, the armor is definitely useful. I, you can just jump, and it makes it really hard to knee him, mm -hmm. like uh, for the up air knee follow up. Yep. That being said, I do think that Falcon wins this matchup pretty, pretty solidly. Yeah, I could understand that because I feel like a lot of Yoshi's approaches are aerial based. So all Falcon has to do is just shield when he sees Yoshi approaching in the air. Wow, these nair, Yoshi God. The yeah. pressure that he just put on with those nairs for Beard, like just holding him in disadvantage, was really, really good.
good. Yeah, I mean, he's doing a really good job of mixing up where he's going to be landing with these aerials, and that's helped him out here. Jeez. That's three, three eggs, three eggs in a row. Egg roll, what is that? Is that called yeah. egg roll? Egg roll. Yeah, three in a row. He got up smash. All right, so Yoshi got takes the first stock. I mean, that's fast. <laughs> he got yep. the dustless dash dance for a good five full seconds. That was pretty good. Yep. Oh, I'm trying to get the down B there, but platform gonna save him. Yeah, they were both reading something wild there for a second. Yeah. Beard taking a minute to decide which direction he wants to throw him. Yeah. Goes with up throw. Beard trying, he's throwing a lot of forward smashes and knees. Yeah, I feel like he's starting to get a little bit frustrated in this matchup because it's like Yoshikat's been throwing out hitboxes and just floating on past him and hasn't really been given Beard size and space he, he needs. Oh, it doesn't. oh, he does have his jump. But, but yeah, I, I agree with you. He, he might be going for some risky stuff. I think he really wants to take the start. Yep. Oh, like that right there. That just grab just right underneath his, uh, his nose. Yep. And these platforms are really giving Yoshikad a lot of options to get back to the stage safely here. Yeah. I feel like Yoshikad always picks Battlefield when it's his counter pick. Yeah. I mean, Yoshi's already so heavy, it's hard enough to kill him. Oh, okay. That I mean, finally he's going to take it. Over 190% on yeah. that one stock. Oh my gosh, you just got looking like Fox for a moment there. Yeah, he really, really <laughs> Fox esque. <laughs> Punishes up smash with the knee. Yeah, I mean, may as well get that damage in. Yeah. 5798, this is pretty close suddenly. Yeah. I mean, Falcon's good with rage, so. Yeah, as long as Beard doesn't fall on top of any smash attacks or, uh, you know, let himself get, get hit hovered. By that. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, I think he meant to up smash and it yep. would have hit him on the platform. Probably would have killed yeah. him. Using that egg for a little bit of extra cover there. Yeah, just so they can get back to stay safely. Wow. That would have killed, but it would have really... That'll do it. Man, Falcon's up here just didn't even exist for a moment. Yeah. It, it, you, I saw it start to come out and Yoshi was like, no, that's not there. Yes. My up air's happening. <laughs> He's like, hey. I'm the one with the game that got announced today. Yeah, they're not. You, you, you haven't had a game announced in years, <laughs> so why don't you just cool it? Dang. One day. Someday, maybe. <laughs> Man, I remember. Yoshi back switching characters again? Or who? Someone is. Or maybe no one is. Yoshi. I don't know. Might just be doing controller resets. Make sure everything's maybe. working right. Like I said, Beard does have a hefty little roster. He does not have a D to D. Samus. Okay. okay. Yeah, I've seen Beard Samus quite a bit. Um, Wait, no, 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 no. Yep. It's the other way around. Yeah. Yeah, I think they're uh, yeah. sussing that out. Reminding Yoshi. him of how the uh, character pick yeah, works. Yeah, Yoshkod picks his character first. Yep. Yoshi. Okay. Yep. Yeah, I think Yoshkod was not aware of the yeah. order of operations there. The joys of winning game one, you get the character counter pick for yep. the last game. And the stage counter pick, both. Yep. Get the whole thing. Nerf. Did they just go Omega Dreamland? Why not? Two, one, go. It's all the no. pineapples okay. without the platforms. <laughs> like, why are we at Omega Dreamland? <laughs> <laughs> See, why can't Dreamland have that underside? Like, you saw how much oh, more slope no. there was, the yeah. underside of the stage? Yeah. Be so much less salt on that stage. I want a stage that has no hazards, doesn't move or anything, but the bottom of it works the same way as Delfino's platform. Where you can go through it. Oh. I want a stage like that. Oh, it's a music kind of thing. They meant to do music, then they accidentally hit Omega instead of music. Yeah. That's what it was. I but mean, yeah, I like the stages that you can go up to the bottom. One, yeah, it definitely makes it a lot more difficult to edge guard against people because of that. It's really good for Falcon. I wonder why. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's pretty easy to edge guard. I don't know if you ever played against him. Yeah. <laughs> I used to love Delfino. Do you remember you were around back then? Delfino yeah. was by far my favorite shoe. Yeah, I personally would have preferred uh, Halberd to stay around. Halberd I didn't mind, but I didn't like the stupid cannon and stuff. And you get trapped underneath oh, the love those. side of the stage. I love yeah. the cannon. You just hold the person there as the laser beam is firing off. It's like, well, you're at kill percent. I'm a not. Let's see who survives this. Yeah, I was really <laughs> bad at not getting hit by that and the bomb. I didn't really like that stage. Yeah. The only one I really like was Delphine. Beard is off to a much better start than he was in the first game. Yeah, I mean, he's definitely able to punish Yoshgod as he's trying to approach a little bit better with all these projectiles he's got. Yeah, Samus is a lot better at uh, 
not getting juggled. Yeah. Way better at not getting juggled. Oh, I thought we were just gonna let it rip right there. Yeah. Grab releases him. Huh. There it is. Honestly, though, I like this matchup right now because this is a 64 matchup. On a 64 stage. Exactly. Yeah. Oh, the air dodge. Yoshi got ready for that. Hit him with the A. That almost killed him. Jeez. Oh, that air. Kill. Deleted Yoshi. <laughs> Looking like Bayo out here. Yeah. Samus' back air is one of her best moves. Yep. Honestly, that dash attack, I feel, is her best move, though. That dash attack is her best move. It's it's undeniable. Her dash attack is her best move and the best Ooh. dash attack besides maybe Meta Knight's. Yeah. Ganondorf has a pretty good one, too, but I'm, I'm pretty sure that Samus and Meta Knight have yep. un like easily the best two dash attacks. Yeah. Um, but her nair and her back air are both really good. Even her Ooh. forward airs yeah. covers her well. Yeah. Um, Yoshi got only taking 29 damage before he gets a stock, too, so this is still very doable. He just yep. eats that charge shot right into the Ooh. face, though, so now he's at 61. Yeah, that's an easy 20-plus percent there. Yeah. Well, this is a scary thing. Yoshi god has been doing a pretty good job of popping Beard and Stein up and keeping him yeah. off the ground as long as he can. Yeah, that, we've seen that happen multiple times this set, where he just, once he hits Beard, he hits him a lot. <laughs> yeah. I mean, that's really what you have to do. Oh, my God, that would have killed not get hit by that nose. Yeah. He does have the charge shot, but I think he wants to hold it until he knows it'll kill. Jumps right through the forward air because Yoshi's super armor. Now the charge shot will, will kill. Yeah. I mean, unless he shoots him all the way across from the other side, it might not, but. Yeah. Don't get forward air. Oh my gosh, I'm so nervous for him to get forward air. Oh, oh and then Yoshi got just SDs. His last, last hit situation, game three, last stock, and he just SDs. That's a bummer. Yeah. I mean, that's definitely a frustrating way to go out, but. Yeah. That's how it goes sometimes. Yeah. 